And three children aged around five were hit and killed by a lorry on the Belgoria Expressway on Kolkata's northern outskirts today. Two other children were injured and rushed to a hospital. All five were on their way to school and crossing the expressway at Rabindranagar. The driver and the assistant of the lorry, which was carrying sand, fled before police arrived. Two police vehicles were set on fire by angry people who gathered there. My colleague Manadipa Banerjee joins me live on the phone line from Kolkata now. Manadipa, what is the state of the other two children who are in hospital and have the police got any leads just yet? Well, uh, you know, very, very chaotic situation over there. We are being told that uh, there was even a lucky charge. In fact, there was a lucky charge on the angry uh, locals who had gathered on the spot. Uh, that lucky charge, uh, you know, some people were injured, people more angry and, of course, agitated about the death of three children two more injured, two in hospital. One of them, uh, his condition is believed to be critical. So the tension in the area is still running very high. However, in the last half hour, police have managed to bring some kind of control onto the area. The burning vehicles have been gouged and towed away. The truck has been towed away. But locals there are very, very angry, they say. Despite the fact that, you know, Crossing the expressway like that is illegal. There is no crossing for people on the expressway. But locals say that the police are the ones who, you know, uh, take money from these trucks when they pass. This is why the trucks drive at breakneck speed to avoid being stopped by the police. And that is why this truck was doing the same thing and hit the children and killed three of them on the spot. So the local anger is huge. Police had a tough time controlling the situation, resorted to a lucky charge, and have now managed to open one lane in the expressway. The burning vehicles have been doused, taken away, the lorry taken away. There are some reports that locals managed to catch the driver and the khalasi or assistant in the lorry, but that is still not being confirmed by the police.